Welcome to Lowbrow Gaming, my name is Lars and this is, by popular request, Hollow Knight. I know it's a metroidvania, and I know it's got a pretty massive fan base. I know it's got cutesy art, and I know it might be difficult. That's pretty much all I know, so as usual, let's just jump straight in without knowing anything, going blind, and, and so on. In wilds beyond, they speak your name with reverence and regret. For none could tame our savage souls, yet you the challenge met. And the palest watch you taught, we changed. Base instincts were redeemed. A world you gave to bug and beast as they had never dreamed. So then, this series comes on the tail end of another playthrough of Rain World. And uh, it was suggested that since I like Rain World so much, I might like this a lot too. I hope you guys are right. The bug blatter beast of Troll. I guess what's going to separate this from Rain World, or my, at least my playthrough of Rain World, is that uh, the Rain World playthrough was pretty pacifist, non-violent, and whatnot. And uh, this, if the sword is going to be an indicator, I think this one is going to contain some uh, some violence. So let's uh, let's see how we do with uh, a bit more violence. All right. Into the hole, the depths of hell, or something. Here we go. Those might be health. Who knows? Let's attack the grass. Figure out what we're doing here. Uh, I know there are dash buttons, but we cannot dash yet. A game by Team Cherry. Cool. We can jump and attack, and that's about the gist of it. You're there. You will die. Now collect your thing coins. This is a hole. Oh, did I hurt myself? I think I might have hurt myself. Cool. Uh, this looks great so far. I must say. Or see, platforming. Well, we knew that was going to happen, weren't we? Didn't we? Oh, glowy bits are showing us where to go. Glowy bats, rather than glowy bits, I guess. Now, what are you? Coin cash. Secret door? No secret door. All right. Well, I'm going to call these bats, because I have no idea. Leave a comment if you want me to refer to them as something else. Cutting all of the things. Things are falling from above. That's great. Now, what's this? Inspect. High beings, these words are for you alone. Your great strength marks you amongst us. Focus your soul, and you shall achieve feats of which others can only dream. Right, so it's soul. Collect soul by striking enemies. Once soul is collected, hold circle to focus soul and heal. Nice! We've healed. Excellent. We've learned something today. We can cut grass, jump, and heal ourselves if we kill enough things. Hey there, glowy. No. Hey there, flying beast. There we go. Killed, slain, defeated, and uh, we are the winner. We are the victor. Right, let's see if. We... It's the age old mantra, isn't it? Let's see what's up before we go down. Let's see. Something's gonna fall down. We jump over there, no? Alright. Cool. Let's see why that platform is there, but we'll figure that out later, I guess. Oh, hello. That was lucky. Or, oh, I mean, scripted. Uh, let's see. Oh, those flowers seem ominous somehow. Uh, let's kill this thing first. Collected soul. Right, we found. Is there some sort of shrine? 
Oh, not anymore. Here we go. Hollow Knight. This, this is, I don't know. This is freaking me out. Ah! Okay, it's infusing me with, oh, I get extra health. Look at that up there. Got extra blobs of health, I think. It's some sort of buff. Or something. Secret door? No. No secret doors. Alright. Uh, wait. We said to go down, didn't we? Let's go down. Map this out. Okay. Bit of a challenge, I guess. What? Kill you, sir. Oh! Oh, crap. <laughs> Oops. My mistake. Let's get back. There we go. Right, that platform does something. Does it, like, disintegrate something if I stand on it too long? No? It's just an effect? Okay. Never mind then. Now, what's this? Oh, it's another one of those soul... I don't know. I want to refer to them as chests, because that's sort of mechanically what they, uh... What they, uh, <laughs> remind me of. All right. That's a bit off with the timing for the jumps and whatnot still, but that's uh, just going to take some getting used to, I guess. It's been so long since I've recorded stuff, and I must say I'm actually kind of surprised with myself that I get this, that I'm able to keep this jibber-jabber going. All right, we need to get a double jump or a wall jump or something to get up here, because Metroidvania, that's how it does. That's how we do. That's how it works. Oh, man. Okay, we didn't get sent too far back. All right. So the things in the bottom don't actually seem like that spikes per se. Seems like they're almost alive. Okay. Let's see what's up. Wait, let's actually just go in here and see. Bing, it says, it's it a secret, maybe? Who knows? Uh, well, we can't really go here until we get some sort of dash or some sort of sprint or some sort of double jump or whatever, but it said, bing! Hold on, do we have a map? Let's press some other buttons and see if we have a map. We don't have a map that, no, no button. Oh, there we go, inventory. Okay, we've got soul, we've got Old nail. Cool. Um, what we were looking for, though, was a map. Wait, these are just inventory slots that we haven't filled yet, I guess. Okay, so no... No map. Fine, let's just keep going. Get out of this hole. There we go, because this is where we fell down, right? Cool. Kill all things, and then inspect the, the glowy bits. High beings, these words are for, you, are for you alone. Beyond this point, you enter the land of king and creator. Step across this threshold and obey our laws. Okay. Bear witness to the last and only civilization. The eternal kingdom. Hallow Nest. Let's go into Hallow Nest and kill some things. Brute forcing our way. Because that's that's all we know. Right, uh we dumped. Kill the grass. Grass is probably dangerous. Or poisonous or kill us. Or it might be snakes, it might be a mimic pole or something. Mimic grass. Alright, hollow nest. No. Dirt mouth. Or dirt mouth. The Fading Town. Hello, sir. Oh, Chitari. Oh there, traveler. I'm afraid there's only me left to offer welcome. Our town's fallen quiet, you see. The other residents, they've all disappeared. Headed down that well, one by one, into the caverns below. Used to be there was a great kingdom beneath our town. It's long fell to ruin, yet it still draws folks into its depths. Wealth, glory, enlightenment. That darkness seems to promise all things. I'm sure you too seek your dreams down there. 
Well, watch out. It, it's a sickly air that fills the place. Creatures turn mad and travelers are robbed of their memories. Perhaps dreams aren't such great things after all. Creepy dude. Will you keep saying the same, same thing? Many used to come, hoping the kingdom would fulfill the desires. Hallow Nest, it was once called. Supposedly the greatest kingdom there ever was. Full of treasures and secrets. Hmm. Now it's nothing more than a poisonous tomb full of monsters and madness. Everything fades eventually, I suppose. Akala, Emtono. Feeling tired? That bench may be iron, but I assure you it's quite comfortable. There's no better place to collect your thoughts before heading below. Plus, I enjoy the company. Not that you seem the talkative sort. Alright. That's it. What's in here? Nothing at all. I'm gonna skip that bench for now in case something happens. Inspect! For all your mapping supplies, we will be opening soon. I see, that's where we get the map. Wait. Is Zelda and Cornifer. Those are cool names. I like those names. Alright, that's the well. We'll go down below into the depths of hell. And what's over here? Graveyard. And... A stone door with a simple lock. All right? Need to find keys. Cool. So let's go check out that bench before we check out the well. These are the things and the course of action and the chronology of... Hello! Welcome to Lowbrow Gaming. Rest. Oh, what happened now? Oh, we get replenished energy and whatnot. That's what happens when we rest. Zing! And then we save also, it seems. We get some sort of symbol down in the corner. And I'm guessing that's, you know, the save icon, the thing. These things that happen, so on. Let's go down the well. All right. Forgotten crossroads, AKA down the well, down the hatch, Mary Poppins. A he, a he, a fiddle, a dee. Idaho, and down with the Nazis. You there, you will die. I'll collect your soul. Okay, I might die. No? All right. Hold to focus. There we go, got health back. Cool. Hello there, monsters. Right, so we just going to the left. <laughs> this is, for some reason, any time I play a platformer or a Metrovania, my natural instinct is to go left, not right. Up and right is the the general norm, right? Thomas was alone. Um, but yeah. Oh shit. Right, that's an elevator. A lift, if you will. Let's see what's in here. Oh no, someone's sad. Oh, poor guy. Are you a boss? Probably. Okay. I'm just gonna assume that you're a boss. Hey! Don't cry. I'm here to help. Hey there. Alright, what are we missing here? Need to do something in this room to trigger something or other. Huh, okay. I'll re definitely remember that guy. Crying mustache worm. Right. So enemies respawn. Whoops. Ah, oh, that's a big drop. Ah, oh, shit. Okay, we dropped a long way down. Uh, let's just go off to the right. No, <laughs> the other right. Inspect. The Pilgrim's Way. Travelers of Hallow Nest descend through verdant wilds and fungal groves to the city at this kingdom's heart. There, all wishes shall be granted, all truths revealed. Cool. Cool, cool. Hello. You're a biggin. Whoa. All right. Let's get close to you. Oh, you're blocking. All right. How do we, uh, 
What do we do about that? Alright, alright, we can't actually defeat you until we get some sort of ranged ability or something. Or... Oh, shit! Oh, that hurt. What if we... No, can't fire that. Back. Fine. Guess we uh, return later on for this one. Hey, bugs. Thank you. Need that to heal. Great. Okay. Liking this game so far. Liking it a lot, actually. So, uh, let's see. Where do we go? Let's go try... Let's try going to the right, then. All right, so spamming the attack button doesn't really... Uh, is not very... Uh, it's not great. Because uh, it, it just throws your timing off. So, I feel like attacking deliberately... Oh is better, though right there I just kept spamming the button, of course. Swallowing my own words immediately. Because this is Swallow Knight, no. It is not, it is not. It is Hollow Knight. So, oh, bugs. Oh shit. Oh no, <laughs> I'm really bad at this little fight here. Right, no matter, we got tons of soul. Though I wonder, maybe that little pool that now says 100, maybe that's also a currency. We've been, uh, we've encountered stuff like that before. Salt and Sanctuary sort of comes to mind. Oh, that's why it's crying. I know why you're crying. Hey, dude. We need to free you and get you back to your papa. All right. Can't do that until we get some uh, leaping abilities. And uh, I don't know, maps would help in this place. Tried being a bit more deliberate there, but also need to. Oh, that's the pointy guy. Oh shit! And a jumpy dude. Right. So we need to give these guys names at some point. So we've got Ladybug, we've got Rhino, and Todd. Hey Todd. Um. Hey, Todd. Oh, okay, Todd is a jumpy guy. Alright, we are going in just a random direction. Who's to say what we're going to find? Alright, bug. Scissor bug. Oh, shit! Shit! Sh ah, no! Death. And we get sent all the way back. Of course we do. Dartmouth, the fading town. So what do we get to retain here? Let's see. We can't... Yeah, opening soon. So you can see the bulbul there is broken. I'm just going to guess that if we backtrack to where we were, we might get our soul back. Dark soul style. Also salt and sanctuary. As previously mentioned. There we go. Now where did we fall? That's where we are. That's our soul. I'm just going to say that's our soul. There we go. Do not knock me into the spikes again, please. Oh, shit! What the... F right, I thought it attacked me there for a second, but that's the spike, I guess. Oh, hello! Weapon! Hello! How do we... How do we... How do we... Can I... Hello? Can I pick you up? Alright, never mind then. You there, bug. Good. Let's heal again. Alright, so far all of our theories have been correct in terms of how uh, the soul system works. Oh! We do not know about currency yet, though, but I'm assuming that's going to be the case. So, we're not draining the... Right, so these coins... Oh! <laughs> Didn't mean to go down there, but now we did. Alright, cool. We can go up. So they work as the elevators of Super Metroid. Oh my god. Oh, shit. 
Big mistake. So, I'm just gonna make sure that I've got this right now. I'm healing. And, yeah. Can't heal anymore. But it's also not draining the coin count. So the coins are not souls. I thought those were sort of like sort of pieces of soul. Or something. Right. Desperately want a map. But we'll get one eventually. We doing a complete circle yet? There we go. Get to heal again. Now where are we? Ooh. Glowy. Glowy temple place. Could it be? No. Temple of the Black Egg. Nah, me no bis. Hello there. How delightful to meet another traveler on these forgotten roads. You're a short one, but you've got a strong look about you. I'm Quirrell. I have something of an obsession with uncharted places. This ancient kingdom holds many fascinating mysteries and one of the most intriguing of them is standing right before us. A great stone egg lying in the corpse of an ancient kingdom. And this egg, is it warm? It certainly gives off a unique air. Can it be opened? There are strange marks all over it. I do so love a mystery. And who knows what other marvels lie even deeper below us. Nah, me no bis. For so long I've felt drawn here. So many tales full of wonders and horrors. No longer could I resist. I just had to see it for myself. And what a time I chose to arrive. This dead world has sprung to life. The creatures are riled up and the earth rumbles. The air is thick. I wonder what could have brought it all about. To persevere in this ruin, that old nail alone just won't be enough. Though that's no problem. One only has to look around. Plenty have come before us and most have met their grisly end. Many more equipped than you and I. I'm sure they wouldn't mind were a fellow explorer to relieve them of their tools. It's a kindness really. The dead shouldn't be burdened with such things. Nah, me no bis. Did you pass that town above? What a gloomy little place. And such majesty hidden right beneath. I suppose that's why they've all headed down here. Who could resist such possibilities? Hmm. Truly a marvel. Hmm. Alright. Hello. Glowy bits. This is what we saw in the opening cutscene. Alright. Temple of the Black Egg. Observed. There we go. Uh, let's just... Right. Something up here, perhaps? Is that where we came from? No, this is... Whoa. Hello. Oh, shit. Okay. Ah, oh, really bad at... Jumping away from that. Stopping to heal isn't really a uh, easy thing either, but we'll try. Oh shit. Again. Alright, there we go. Woo! Hey, we did it. Wow. I did not think <laughs> we were gonna survive that first mini boss fight. Oh, here we go. Hey, dude. Alright, I think we've got one baby back to the crying dad. Let's go, uh, let's go there then. See uh, if anything's changed. There we go. Was it the top one? Was it the bottom one? There we go. Ah, thank you. Thank you. Alright, at least we got some reward. Thank you so much for watching this first episode of Hollow Knight. I am thoroughly enjoying myself, and if you are too, leave a comment below this video, and subscribe if you haven't already, and if you want to see other things that we make, just click one of these that are showing up on screen right about now. The Funk Soul Brother. Check it out now.